After losing his brother Jimmy in a shuttle explosion, Spike and his father Sparkplug deal with the situation differently. Spike and his girlfriend Carly head off stargazing, however an earthquake sends them falling into the Ark starship where they discover the Autobot and Decepticons. Cobbs. Jetfire triggered the earthquake so he could enter the ship trapped on the side of the mountain. He activates Teletran 1 to reassemble his friends starting with Starscream who shoots Bumblebee in the face. Starscream shoots Jetfire for interfering however he is engaged by the newly assembled Optimus Prime and Ratchet. Now Skywarp joins the fight as well as Soundwave while Ratchet loads the remaining Autobots into Optimus Prime's trailer. Spike and Carly help Optimus against Ravage and decides instead of dealing with more Decepticons it is better to destroy Teletran 1. Optimus and Ratchet get away with Spike and Carly as Starscream and Skywarp follow. Jetfire arrives, engages Starscream and Skywarp who retreat due to low energy. They attack a power plant where he kills Sparkplug's friend. Bumblebee being destroyed by Starscream was a highlight in this issue as the character is overexposed in the movies. We also discover this takes place after Void Rivals 1, where Jetfire wakes up and heads to Earth to awaken his friends. For $3.99 this is a bargain issue compared to other comics who have less than an eighth of the story. Looking forward to this new series as well as the upcoming G.I. Joe comics which will link to this issue with Duke and Cobra Commander. Subscribe for more comic news and upcoming events.